Holly ho there. Now, please excuse the mess. I've just get a rig this. Uh, this is the Asus Zephyrus. Just get a rigged it onto this monitor here, uh, which is a 144 hertz monitor there. And just gonna see how does it game? Can it compare to this desktop here, which actually has the same sort of specifications, GTX 1080, has a desktop class CPU, of course. This has a um, laptop class CPU, but it does have a GTX 1080 as well, but it's Max Q. So theoretically this laptop should be slower than that, but I've already played it. I can't tell the difference. Honestly, I cannot tell the difference. So let's get into it. Let's game and see how it goes. All right, let's see how this Asus Republic of Gamers Zephyrus games. GTX 1080, Max Q, it has the um, HQ 7700 CPU quad core. And you can see the telemetry on the top left. And I've got a guest here. Is is that who is it? Yes, is that, it's Dodgy Dave. Dodgy, are you the wall shooter? Where are we going, Mansion? Yes, I'm the wall shooter. Yeah, we're going now. Old, old, old place mansion. mansion. Yep, Mansion. So at the moment, I mean, it's not pushing it hard. Um, 65 degrees GPU, 74 degrees, 76 degrees CPU. And the CPU is 3.5 gigahertz, which is very fast for this CPU. Getting a hundred fine. Where, 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 where going? Oh, I jumped too late. No, I, I, I pulled. I pulled <laughs> I was early. Talking too much crap, mate. I pulled early. Oh, you pulled early. You pulled out early. Uh, yeah. Yeah, oh. I pulled out early. Damn it. All We're right, gonna see if it's so, a motorbike on our corner. Mate, this is amazing. This has the performance of pretty much the desktop, like same frames per second I'm getting, uh, 1080p, um, mixture of uh, very high set, no, high settings, and medium uh, view distance and high uh, anti-aliasing. Oh, that's not my, that's not you, and there's someone landing near me, okay. That's fine. Where are you? Are you did you make the mansion? No, no. Can you hear the laptop? No, because I've got. Okay, so I've got the um, the microphone pretty much over the top of the laptop, and look, buttery smooth, 140 frames per second. That's exactly what I get on the desktop GTX 1080. Like, literally no difference. It's amazing. It's really good. I mean, the temperature, CPU, it's in the 80s. It does get up to 90s sometimes, but it doesn't throttle. I'm gonna the biggest difference here is it's got the Max Q, right? And the Max Q will generally be around 1600, 1700 uh, megahertz, whereas the actual desktop variant will typically boost to 1900. So are you in the mansion? No, I'm miles away. I'm getting oh shot God. at. Okay. I'm at um, the warehouse. You know the warehouse where you go to? Oh, after yeah, the you're mansion. Down there. Yeah, getting shot. All right. I'm going to come. Try, I'm going to try and find a car and pick you up. Oh, I wanted to go to the mansion. Now it is loud. I can hear it, but every gaming laptop's loud. But <coughs> um, oh, holy crap! What happened there? But this is no louder than any other laptop, which is really surprising considering how thin this is. So I've got this hooked up to an external monitor, 144 hertz monitor external. And you can see we're getting the perfect amount of frames there. Actually, I think this is actually faster than the desktop, man. I don't know why. Is it because they've just patched it? Because this was the six gigabyte um, update. Are you getting smoother frame rates or faster? Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. The patch, whatever they did, is it's, it's nice and smooth. It. You know what they done? They um, what they done is they reduced the view distance when you jump out of the plane because that was killing the server. Like it was loading up the big map or whatever, uh -huh. and. The, 
jump. And that was just killing the server. And that's why you're getting those synchronization issues. Because I read through the patch notes. This is super buttery smooth because of that G Sync. And it seems to be working on the external monitor, so. Boom. It is super smoothy. There's no um there's no drop frames or sorry, micro stutters like the desktop I have micro stutters all the time. I haven't tried it on this patch, I will. And I'll compare it to the um the desktop variant later on. You'll get to see that. But how good is it? Oh yeah, I haven't got a gun, I've got nothing. You got no gun? Oh, yep. Got nothing. You've been in this um, warehouse, yeah? No, oh, I thought it was somebody there, so I wanted to... You want to... Yeah, I'll come over with you, because I hadn't had a gun, so I couldn't... Oh, stuff all here. Must Somebody's... Been, uh, there must have been someone here, and I've only got a shotgun. Yeah, somebody was over the next buildings, because that's where I got shot. Super smooth. I'll get a handgun, at least it's something I can fight with. And I'm also Dang. recording gameplay, so... With the NVIDIA uh, shadow play, so that should affect the frame rates, but I'm getting max, like, perfect. I'll have to try it at higher resolution. Oh, oh, oh. No! oh. Hello, got shot by two of them. I am not. All right, I'll wrap this one up here, this recording. I'll test it at some high resolutions and... Yeah. Oh, oh, don't you love me? Right, tell you how, now I'm on the desktop. I'll just show you that I'm on the desktop. Uh, where we got here? System. We have the 6600K 3.5 gigahertz, which can boost to 4 gigahertz, no problems. And... Uh, the graphics cards, what do we have here? We have the GTX 1080 G1 Gaming Gigabyte graphics card. So I'm comparing this to the Zephyrus, which one performs better. You would expect that this desktop here should be able to beat the Zephyrus, the Zeus Zephyrus laptop, considering it has a laptop um, CPU and also it has a Max-Q. Um, GTX 106, 1080, sorry. So I would expect that this desktop would be faster, but I said before, I can't tell the difference. And an actual fact, looks like it's gonna be slower this desktop, which makes me feel sad because my desktop oh, yeah. is not as fast as this laptop. <laughs> anyway, we'll see what happens once we hit the ground. All right, mansion, have to go to mansion. Mansion is the place to go. All right, so I expect the frames to go up, obviously here, 3.6 gigahertz. Uh, and you'll see that with these um, desktop uh, 1080s, you will get 1900 up to about 2000 boost clock, where the Max-Q version of the 1080 in the Zephyrus you will get up to 1700 megahertz and that's basically the difference there hello we've got one person there oh, you can go in the mansion i'll go in the big one how about that that sound good but um i was getting 140 frames 130 140 oh, that's nice uh frames per second with the zephyrus and I'm certainly not getting those same frame rates with this desktop, which is a little bit strange, but um, it is what it is. The numbers don't lie. Exactly the same settings, by the way. I have not changed the settings. I always use the same settings. I'll go take out this guy. We'll try and take him out anyway. Oh, here we go. Now, we're getting 120, 130. See, it's still the Zephyrus was faster. 
We're getting up to 140. Oh, ah, low. Okay, did not see him. And as you can see, the Zephyrus was faster. I literally told you I could not tell the difference and I can't. They feel very similar playing. They feel both the same gaming. Like I literally can't tell the difference, but I can see here the desktop is not running as fast as the Zephyrus. Of course, this is PUBG and the frame rates just vary game to game. And I will do a suite of tests where I test this compared to the desktop, the Zephyrus compared to the desktop, and you'll see probably the desktop will come out on top, obviously, over so many games it will. But just generally playing, I cannot tell the difference between the two. And you saw it with your own eyes. PUBG, it was quicker. So we'll see what happens. And thanks for watching, guys. If you're new around here, please subscribe. And until next time, guys, tally ho.